Hello, everybody. You are back for another Saturday special. Saturday um, unboxing. Boxing. Also, uh, it's Cat Saturday today, just so you know. It's our first Facebook Cat Saturday. Yeah. We probably won't even like continue doing this. Next week, we'll probably forget to yeah. put pictures of our cat. I put a picture of my cat on, and somebody said, kill it. <laughs> so, <laughs> let's yeah. get to the unboxing, then. Okay. What do we got today? See? Uh, let's go with this guy here. Lot. Ooh. 40. Excellent. We are doing a little bit of a run yeah. on some Canadian whiskeys. Yeah. Uh, so this one. From our homeland. From the homeland here. This one was rated very, very well. On, on here it just says 97 points by the wine enthusiast. In 2014 it won Canadian Whiskey Award. Hmm. Well, we'll decide if it's any good, won't we? Double gold medal. Beauty. Wow. This is the Lot 40 single... Copper Pot Still Canadian Whiskey. Excellent. All right, let's get up here and uh, get un uncorking, unboxing. All right. Show the people the full bottle. Oh, yeah. Here, have a, have a little look-see on there. It's kind of a interesting shape. It kind of has the, the tall shoulders on the bottle here. They've got a little bit of the um, wording on the side. Label kind of is a cool kind of trick. Kind of, kind deal, of embossed there. looking... Uh sketching into it sort of this stuff. is 43 percent alcohol this particular one so let's uh let's get it, it done. If, we, if we can let's get it undone mm, here it comes Ooh, i wonder if it's a cork or if it's a cap we have a real cork a cork excellent Fantastic. that's something we usually complain about yeah the canadians oh there nice. it is a little spillage too perfect all right. Get it out of way cool all right let's try it out 43 percent 43 percentage points. So, for people that don't know Canadian whiskey too well, it is a different animal altogether compared to bourbons mm -hmm. and Irish and Scotch and things like that. So, uh, oh, nice color on it. Well, I'm bringing it all over the place. Oh, good. Soaking it into the uh, into the <laughs> tablecloth there. Good. Uh, so, I don't know too much if they've uh, added color to this one or not, but we'll get some research done when we do a full review on it. Absolutely. But, uh, yeah, Canadian whiskey is often rye, but uh, now there's a lot of single malts being made. Yeah. Um, there's some imitation bourbon being made in Canada, that's for sure. It's, it, there's actually, one, one called BRBN. BRBN out of, uh, out of I think, Kelowna there. But, uh, yeah, so there's some good stuff that the Canadian whiskey is making right now, but the, the rules are a little bit different, and color can be added, flavor can be added. They can um, call it rye without it being any rye in it, it yeah. all corn. There's some wacky stuff which makes it a whole different kind of beast. So yeah. anyway, we'll get into that later. Let's... Uh, on first nose though, like pretty good. Pretty flavorful. I like it. Great nose on it. Again, we're going to get into a lot more detail when we do the full review. This is just our first tasting, first, first reaction. Passion. So let's, let's Smell understand. is good. Mmm. It has, nice. it, it has a little of that, that uh, Guderham and Wurtz kind of vibe to it. Yeah, a little bit of a, yeah. a tingle to it there too. Um, mm -hmm. But these guys make a, uh, they make a, this is the single pot still, copper pot still. They also make a, a rye. These are both, I think, 100% rye, but anyway. Um, the top here says it is 100% rye. So there you go. There's your research for that's the day. The research. Are you going to um, add some water? I'm going to add just a touch of water because... Uh, it does open it up a little bit, just a little bit. Mm. I like the nose on this one though a lot. It's quite this good. is good. Mm. So I think people go out and buy it if you can find it. Yeah, we'll give you a full review here in the coming weeks, months, and uh, we'll see you next Saturday for another unboxing of some kind. But uh, yeah, we're enjoying it. So stick around for another episode every Thursday at six o'clock. Saturday at 4 o'clock Pacific Standard Time. Cheers! Ooh, it sounds nice.